is a public service an announcement to remind you to check your tire pressures. Ride safe, my friends, and keep the rubber side down. So this is going to be one of my crude videos. I'm doing this really quick because I ain't got time. I'm trying to get the bike ready for nationals. Got a bunch of stuff to do. Anyways, I got a Code 11, which is my speedometer and operative. You can tell when you're riding down the road and the speedometer is inoperative. I just thought it was kind of funny. Anyways, I'm going to show you real quick the tests and the connectors for the 05 VTX 1800 on how to diagnose a vehicle speed sensor circuit, or the sensor itself. We're going to test this circuit, find out what's going on so I can get the parts ordered. So, let me show you what we're doing. Huh. If you pull the cover off on the side there, pull it back a little bit to see. You have a bunch of stuff in there. I've already got it partially apart. This connector right here was fed through here, plugged in to this right up in there. You can barely see on the right hand side that open socket. And these three wires, I got the green and the black and the pink. The pink is your signal wire and the other two are battery power and ground to the sensor. I'm going to hook up a voltmeter, see that those two are, I actually see it on these two, that these two are getting power and ground. And then I'm going to raise the bike up, spin the wheel and see if I'm getting any kind of signal out of this pink wire. So, being that I only have one hand. It's going to be a little bit shoddy and spotty, but I'm going to kind of tell you what I'm doing and what the results are, so I'm tight. Hi, me again. All right, so I took my voltmeter and went to the harness side of the bike, double check all the battery voltage, and I've got battery voltage there, so that part's good. Um, now I'm going to raise up the rear of the bike so I can spin the tire and get the, uh, if I, I'm going to see if I get a signal voltage when I spin the retire um, and I think it's going to confirm that the speed sensor is bad so tight. Alright so I'm going to show you my last thing uh, as far as the factory manual I hook up the voltmeter between the pink and the green wire and I spin the tire and look at voltage. I've got those two hooked up going to a good reliable voltmeter and when I spin it I get nothing. I'm actually checking it on AC and DC just to make sure and I'm not getting any kind of signal at all whatsoever so looks like I'm gonna go and order myself a speed sensor. On my next videos I'll be showing you how much fun it was to change. Stay tuned, thank you for watching, any questions, comments, feel free to post, feel free to support the channel, hit that like and subscribe button, share with your friends, your enemies, and all that other good stuff, and like always, keep the rubber side down, my friends, stay safe.